contact between the umbilical and the pipeline. This field cam program is a compulsory subject for the 6th semester students. The purpose is to map an area, so we can examine and apply what we have been studying in lectures. Basically, the students are simulating and experiencing the whole engineering process of principal terrestrial mapping. Bringing in for about a hundred of Itebe Geodetic students into the green forest of Gunung Masigit Karambi, Garut, West Java. Unlike before, this year we are accompanied by a dozen of Institute Technology Sumatra students. The 
generate a topographic map as an output. Several modules are conducted. We organize ourselves into certain divisions and certain working system. Certain group of amateur surveyors are going to map the area within a hundred hectares for the next 15 adventurous days from the 17th until the 31st of May 2015. This is our base camp. We are planning, briefing, evaluation, and almost everything took place. Some of the boys and girls stay overnight here. And this is our platoon tent, where the rest of male students are sheltering. By 7 o'clock, most teams start to mobilize themselves into each survey spot. Horizontal control network is a set of control points for which horizontal coordinates x, y that have been accurately determined. Those can be identified with physical points on Earth's surface, in this case, marked by wooden stakes, and necessarily used to provide horizontal coordinates for other survey points. Using total station, we can measure angles and distances between control points in order to triangulate the XY position of those observed points. Dah! Dah cus! Cabut ya cabut! By noon, each team has recess routine on the field. We pray, have catering lunch, and a moment to catch our breath before continue to further survey modules. <laughs> Nevertheless, the geometry of the network has not been controlled yet on the vertical axis. 
In precise leveling, a series of measurements between two points are taken using an optical water pass and measuring rod. Differences in height between the measurements are added and subtracted in a series to get the net difference in elevation between the two end points. Tengah, tiga, enam, eh, tiga, enam, sembilan. Atas, tiga, sembilan, tujuh. Bawah, tiga, empat, satu. These horizontal and vertical data measurements should meet the maximum allowable tolerance. Otherwise, the measurements should be repeated until they fulfill. As hour elapsed, trees are dancing, and the sun is setting, telling us it is already the time to go home and have some rest. As the sun rays reach the ground, a bunch of surveyors are on their pathway towards their survey locations. Our daily commute time is on the average of 20 to 30 minutes long on foot. The aim of this module is to map the situation of significant detail objects and contour, which illustrates topography. What kind of objects are being surveyed? Well, this depends on what information you want to provide on the map, and also the map scale. Land use is referring to housing, public facilities, farms, macadam, and pathway. While on the other hand, river, wetland, forest, and agriculture are classified as land cover. Applying tachyometry method, objects and contour points are measured from geodetic control network that had been established before or assisted through supplement auxiliary control points which measured relative to the network. There are plentiful data and measurements. Almost 8,000 survey points have been measured by all of the survey team, spread among the whole area.
udah gitu aja terus jalan tuh kita ngambil tengahnya nah, sungainya tuh kita ambil tepinya nah karena ini tuh ya, sungainya gini terus gini gini kan kita ah, ambil tepi yang tepi yang bagian kanan ya ih ini datanya basah kawan-kawan Aco sedang menjemur ceritanya Tapi tak nampak mukanya ya. As we walked along the macadam footpath I was calm on the outside But thinking all the time How to scramble to queue in the limited public restrooms Before the day begin to dust It's quite horror out there after dark. There might be some stories happened, but we'll save it for later, I think. For now, it was lovely music that came into my aid. In the world of modern technology, where smartphone and Google Maps isn't a new thing anymore, who has not heard of GPS? This geodetic GPS acquires highly accurate coordinates with the accuracy up to millimeters. The coordinates will be used eventually to georeference the whole surveyed set of the network control points. Baseline, satellite's geometry, multipath, measurement method, duration, and instrument specification are few which influence the measurement result. We set up the GPS observation on 7 out of all control points. Oh, so unfortunate. By the way, you can study more thoroughly about the concept and application of GPS from this popular yellow book. Let's see how life in nature is going on on the other side of the forest. <laughs> Beneath our mama spider, a single young arachnid is constructing its orb web. Different groups of spiders build different types of webs. Most orb weavers construct webs in a vertical plane and arguably facing south or north at open air. Eventually, they eat the silk, leaving only the baseline to rebuild on. A herd of chittle deer is listed by the IUCN, International Union for Conservation of Nature and Natural Resources, as being of least concern, because it occurs over a very wide range within which there are many large populations. These herbivorous mammals are active throughout the day. In the summer, time is spent 
in rest under shade and the sun's glare is avoided if the temperature reaches 27 degrees Celsius. Their activity peaks as dusk approaches. On the contrary, tonight we are about to do our following practice module, which we had not done ever before during lectures. Dah ya, ternyata lumayan ya, cukup sulit ya. Gede banget, berat pak. Eh ya, nih. Geodetic astronomy is described as the art and science for determining the positions of points on the earth and the azimuths of the geodetic lines connecting such points. With the help of theodolite and a sheet of star map, astronomical observation is useful for determination of the origin and orientation of independent surveys in remote regions. <coughs> Such activity are common back then, when GPS survey has not been frequently used, or in cases where GPS surveys are not possible or impractical to carry out. Itu ke kiri banget, kanan banget bro, abis bro Bulas, abis bulas Ini mah emang gimana ya? Gak ada ujungnya ya? Ke kiri tuh jadi tak hingga abis Harus di tengah-tengah Ntar ke tengah itu Kalau sayang yang muda, apa alasannya? Apa? Sayang yang muda Sayang yang muda Temperature drops drastically at night. Most of us prefer to sneak out and return to base camp to help the rest of the students finish data processing. Every evening after Maghrib prayer. Most of the Muslims gather around inside the mosque to throw a brief group discussion with vast topics. From the perspective of religion, mau rapat IMG gitu tapi ya mungkin alasannya ya aku mau ngaji atau gimana kan itu sebenarnya ya ngaji mah habu bin Allah gitu biarkan dua pedoman hidup kepadamu jika engkau selalu berpegang teguh kepada dua ini maka niscaya engkau akan bahagia hidup di dunia dan akhirat apa itu ya ini Alquran dan Hadis Subhanahu Wa Taala kita kita harus bersyukur karena ketika kita bersyukur itu segala nikmat yang diberikan oleh Allah Subhanahu Wa Taala akan bertambah Almost every night after survey, we stay up late to work on data processing. Once the surveyor has calculated the level of the errors in his work, it is adjusted. This is the process of distributing the error between all measurements. Each observation is weighted according to how much of the total error it is likely to have cost and part of that error is allocated into it in a proportional way. The most common methods of adjustment are the Bowditch method, the principle of least squares method, 
also the iteration of Dell method. Prior to adjustment, we have to make sure the data that have been corrected so that they are free, whether from blunder or systematic error. This is the last night before we present the final result to our lecturers. Just like high school, there's always that 1% in group project who do less than others. Disappointment. <sighs> we were slaughtered. The output is a planimetric topographical map with a scale of 1 to 2000. Of all technical and non technical problems, unfortunately, there is a big hole of data insufficiency in northern and eastern part of the loop network happens due to dense vegetation, too distant from main network, and extreme terrain, resulting in the incapability of our resources to impenetrate and establish excessive number of auxiliary control points. Therefore, instead of representing the real topography, some parts are being interpolated. Above all, behave more professionally on-site improve communication and coordination between divisions and towards lecturers might have come as a major solution.
We had our fun. This is how our base camp look alike when day off. What a bunch of silly boys. We set up envelopes as many as our member so that we can write anything to each other. <laughs> so lovely. Since it is our last day in the forest before returning home, most students decide to go out to the field play soccer or anything else. But I I would rather climb the hill, sitting on its top and contemplate. At this very moment, I can feel the breeze that rustles and memories of our days gone by. As if Yesterdays and tomorrows intertwine and flash before my eyes. Aku, temanku adalah sahabatku. Sahabatku adalah saudaraku. Dimulai, dimulai. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. 
Saudaraku adalah aku. Thank you buat IMG, thank you buat 2012. Satu dipukul, semua balas memukul. The last day of field camp. Hari ini bukanlah hari akhir buat kita semua. Hari ini adalah hari di mana kita memulai hidup kita yang baru. Ini akan menjadi memori yang tidak akan pernah padam namanya. Tidak ada ITB dan ITERA di sini. Ada ITERA.
Thank you for watching.